Yeah, that is right, Hayley. We are live at Wembley, where in 325 days, the final of the European Championships will be held. And the person who's tasked with hopefully getting England there is Serena Wiegmann and George Mayer. Serena, thank you very much for joining us on Sky Sports News. Welcome to the thank job. You. As we said, we've only been in charge for a few days. How's it gone so far? Good. Uh, I started at St George's Park. It's really amazing there. Uh, got to know some staff members already. Uh, now we're here and uh, next uh, Monday we'll meet the team. You started on September the 1st and you've already had to pull out your squad for the next uh, World Cup qualifiers. How difficult a task was that? Yeah, it was pretty hard because uh, most players came out of the Olympics and they had a break. So we couldn't see uh, very many games. Some had some Champions League games. Uh, the competition started last weekend, so we did get to see them. And our scouting team did a great, great, great job because they, of course, they had all the the players ready for us and uh, we could talk about them and see some footage. So I think uh, we have a very good squad to start with um, on next Monday. Yeah, talk us through some of the selections because obviously there's quite a lot of young players in this squad. Was that yeah. what you're trying to sort of achieve, a, a, a newer, younger looking England? Well, no, I've heard, look, we haven't seen that much yet. And I know England has very many talented players. Uh, but I wanted to expand the squad just a little bit to 25 players because uh, also because of COVID still and we're in the bubble. So when you have an injury or anything else, then it's hard to get players in. Uh, and it's also a chance to see more players uh, and how they relate to each other in the group we are working with. So for us, it's, um, yeah, it's, it's nice to see them. We had some injuries too, so some players we couldn't invite. And it gives a chance to other players to show us in the environment we are in uh, how they relate to their competitors. 